one, you know. Sometimes in the beginning of your porn career, there's yeah. these men that pop up. Yeah, we call them suitcase pimps. <laughs> so that was that was him, and um, we made some very popular videos on the internet, uh, forced by cuckold stuff, uh, pegging, uh, like crazy shit. Oh, so he was very into niche. like some kinky stuff. I mean, he let me fuck his ass as hard as I wanted to. And that's why my form is so good, Holly. Ah, I didn't like this guy, not one single bit. Yeah, but you know, he would let me. He would he would bottom for me, and I would just absolutely go in on him. And so that's how I got my form down, and. Where I started to really like uh, wearing a strap on and and using it, so that was kind of my niche for a little bit. Right, strap ons. Yes, strap on stuff. Which is force by cuckold, whatever. Which is honestly like I will say, like strap on sex is actually not easy to do. Not easy. And I struggled with shooting those kinds of scenes for a while because you have to have like the quality of the strap on matters a lot. Like yeah, you, you know, like those those shitty old ones with like the leather belts or, or or just plastic like. It doesn't hold it in place and it like moves around a lot and then also like the quality of the dildo like it can't yeah. be too hard it can't be too soft like i've used the same strap on and dildo my entire port career i was i kept it the, the, the same brand from new york toy collective and they're the best of the best because it really is a part of you what yeah. are they called it's a the jock strap harness uh-huh by spare parts okay and then the dildo is from new york toy collective you can get both things from there okay okay, okay free shout out alert but yeah but it's true they're, they're the best and you want to give your your bottom the best quality of dick yeah because it's like it can be uncomfortable it can be uncomfortable yeah it wasn't uncomfortable with this suitcase pimp guy but right i made him know that i was there <laughs> <laughs> i wasn't pussyfooting around <laughs> and then also like even just the like like you said your form that's where you got your form it's i mean even form. just like how you thrust your hips matters. Yes. Like there's there's a lot to if strap I can give on. One tip, um, just don't even look at the dildo when you're inside. Okay. Because that can kind of take away from your connection with your bottom. Ah. Because you know, you, you, and, and your head's down, it doesn't look good. Just keep, yeah. keep eyes, keep your eyes ahead. <laughs> okay, got it. And also too, I mean, you know, when you're wearing a strap on, obviously it's not your own penis. Your own I penis. know guys like to look at their own penis when it's going in and out because. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, I think the they're visuals. like, good job, dude. Yeah. <laughs> You're doing great. You look good down there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this reminds me of uh, some performers, some male performers I work with. I swear if they could put just a mirror over my face and just, and just have them just look at themselves, it would be the same thing. I was talking about that with my friend Mike Quasar the other day. And we were talking about some guys who like, we were like, I swear, cause you know how sometimes when guys fail yeah. or they're failing, they'll go into the bathroom with their phone and they'll watch yeah. porn. Even though they're shooting porn, they'll go and like watch porn on their phone it's, it's so to get hard again, experience. which is, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Um, we were talking about like this one guy specifically. <laughs> we're like, just put him in front of a mirror and he'll just get hard looking yeah. at himself. Yeah. Just chuck him, chuck yeah, it off. Any, any nearby mirrors. <laughs> Oh man, you know what? I wish I wish that I loved myself that much. <laughs> I actually hate people ask me a lot why I don't do porn and I'm like, I don't even like looking in the mirror when Ugh. I'm having sex, like much less looking at it on camera and letting everybody else see it like Yeah, yeah. Like I, I got to the, I got me. to the point where I'm like, I'm over the sex tapes. Yeah. I, I think I'd like to keep this to myself now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.